This is on a really nice line, cutting it with the left to right wind. Now, Leishman. I'm going to give Mark an A-plus for that tee shot. Left himself with a really good angle, but just didn't get uh, his pitch shot far enough into the green. Straight up the hill, much like Jason's. On a nice line here, just slightly left of the hole. That should give him an opportunity. Hmm. Just wanders by on the low side of the hole. Now Leishman at the third. You just keep it inside that right bunker. It's interesting. He found 142. This on a nice line, but he's going to need a bounce. He got a bounce. Ooh, got some spin too. Oh yeah. All right, so the first birdie of the day for Mark Leishman comes at three. It's headed right. You can hear him asking for it to stay left. Our distance is just eight or ten degrees that you get half an hour longer. So here's Leishman playing down the left side, just trying to set up his angle for a third shot. Down in the wrong direction there, oh, Ross. Oh, see, because they walk off that to four again. Trying to cut, yeah, now working back perfectly. Oh, there's an interesting illustration, Frank, of how to play. You can just go with his normal. Baby Very fight. nice looking Good. shot. Come on, mate. Hey. Okay. Good. If anything, it's just going to move right. It slows down. Oh. Or maybe just go straight in. <laughs> oh. So Leishman gets the shot back straight away. I think this is intended for the green breeze against here. Playing up the right. Stop. And too far right. That's. Uh, might be out of the bunker. He drove it to the right yesterday, Raj. And yeah, grass is the only thing that kept this ball from going back into the bunker. So really an awkward stance. And he was really kind of forced to play out right. If he didn't pull it a lot, which was possible from that lie, he'd give himself the chance to get it up and in. Of course, with a week off where Leishman said he didn't touch a club, really. Mark, Marky Mark. Coming in here. Mark. But he's picked up right where he left off pretty much. All in all, not too bad right there. All week and last week as well. Oh. That was rude. Perfect call, Roger Malpe. 279 into the breeze and right to left. Wow. That's a big hit. Yes, it is. And that'll get just through the back edge of the green, but no problems there whatsoever. This one should slide to his right on the way down there. May straighten up in the area of the cup. Yeah, that's good pace. That was one you could easily let get away. After a really well played tee shot, and he's staring it down. And now he's talking to it a little. Boy, it was right at it though. It just took two big hops, but that's a good place to putt from. That means you have some work to do. See if you can read it correctly. Mark Rolfing said, tough green to read. So the leader is through nine. His fade perfectly. Oh, did he nail it dead straight? He did. Didn't come back. His boomerang didn't come back <laughs> from the gallery. I want to keep it short of the hole if you can. Sort of like that. Yeah, a little unlucky there, maybe not to get a kick. A little better than 25 feet here, David, and as it comes from off the green, onto the green, should swing left. Ooh, 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 ooh. Oh, he's made good. several of those in the last two weeks. It's Peter, where you really have to control your trajectory. You know, Day got it up in the air, got a little more wind behind it. Yeah, that 
was that's just deep as well. So fast down that hill, he just never got it going. Nice putt here. Got to be a little mindful of the pace. Wow. Boy, he makes a lot of putts. <laughs> He's done that all week. And you go with less than driver. Try to fit the ball between the trees on the right, bunkers on the left. Didn't watch it too long. That's usually a good sign. And that is perfectly positioned. Looks to me if you take it in behind the hole a little bit on the left hand side, it might spin back toward it. Yeah, there's a ridge there, Raj. That is the way we've seen the best shots played, or you can kind of just throw it in there a little left of the hole. That record eagle number to 12. Leishman for yet another birdie. And that one just runs out of speed. Watch how smooth he swings, folks. Swing just like his practice swing with the it real is. one. Well, uh, that's the object, you know, make a practice swing and let the ball get in the way. Nobody ever ruins a practice swing, you know, make a practice swing. Oh, what the heck was that, <laughs> you know? <laughs> this one's slow. There. Oh. Times it perfectly. Some dead weight. And he did the fairway, even though this far five is playing it. Oop, that's going left, I think. It's hard to tell the way he drops the club. Uh, it's not bad at all, but you can imagine, this is about a 1971 par five and a short <laughs> one at that. Maybe a little bit left to right. Puts that club on the nape of his neck on the follow through. And that, uh, sitting up nice anyway. It's good live. Might be into the green though. Let me throw it up in the air. This should release. Yeah, a little yeah. more than he wanted it to. The brakes are magnified. Oh, man, that's <laughs> close. the edge. He Bat speed. Look at the hands just slash through the hitting area. Well, this is right. This will not find the green. Lands softly, Roger, so. Comes in low and hot. Oh, it sound you could hear that click almost. Getting out a bowl of pasta. So have that for his par. And that appears to be pretty good. 176 mile an hour ball speed. Well, Johnny, he really curved this one. Today it's two <laughs> feet. Yesterday it was one foot. <laughs> so. Slides the ball yep. down. She's going to take a big skip when it lands. Wow. Wow. Just over the back of the green. Steeply downhill, all about pace. And that's good. Very nice. Flag right on the front here at 17. Narrow piece of green. Six iron on the way, and that's not a bad miss right in front. Took a couple of bobbles coming off that fringe, but a good effort. Yeah. Yeah, lovely try. Hit it dead straight yesterday down the middle. Let's see if he does it again. That one's leaking a little right, but should be good. Yep. Yeah, he's been really good with the driver. He's good at everything. And I would expect that fade to work here, John. Got to hit a solid to get over that creek. I guess he's done that. Oh, he's done that. Boy, it's online just right of it. Uh, that's not the most wonderful spot right there. That's not a good lie at all. He's just got to dump it out of here onto the fringe or onto the green, and it should run out. But, uh, boy, it was not a good lie. That's very well managed. That is a beautiful touch. And this could end up being a five-shot lead for Leishman if he's able to get that little putt coming back home for, for Mark Leishman who has his first outright 54 hole lead on the PGA Tour and it is a big one five clear of Jason Day and Ricky Fowler at 14 under.